A former Flint police sergeant is accused of sexually assaulting several young people on city property and even inside patrol cars. Tonight, the prosecutor on the case releasing more details about what led to these very serious charges. Good evening, everyone. I'm Stephanie Parkinson. Thanks for joining us tonight. Police say Lawrence Woods committed sex acts on dozens of victims, many under the age of 13, between 1996 and 2000 while he was on the Flint police force. The prosecutor says several victims just recently came forward more than a decade and a half later. NBC 25's Kyle Mitchell is live with our top story and has the latest on the case. Kyle. Stephanie, Genesee County Prosecutor David Layton says the victims that sparked the investigation were afraid and that's why they didn't come forward sooner. He says there's a lot of evidence to support the charges. We believe that uh, they were victimized by this man on, on numerous occasions. Former Flint police officer Lawrence Woods now facing 16 charges of criminal sexual conduct. There were incidents inside the police department and out on the street in uh, police vehicles and on uh, city property. Well, the investigation has been underway for some time. Uh, the young ladies came forward after a significant period of time. The Genesee County prosecutor says a few victims just recently came forward, leading to an investigation and raids of Woods' former residences. Some of the evidence that we recovered yesterday during the raids uh, revealed a large amount of uh, child pornography and uh, uh, not the run of the mill stuff that's off the internet, but uh, these victims were photographed, we believe, by him. Um, in his apartment and at a local hotel room. The prosecutor says the case is very rare. Well, it's highly unusual because 99.9% .9 of police officers are, are good, hardworking, honest citizens who would never even think to commit such an atrocious crime. And Layton says former police officer or not, no one is above the law. Uh, these are very serious charges. They're life offenses. They carry mandatory minimum penalties of up to 25 years in prison. So this is serious stuff. And Stephanie, police think there could be more victims. Investigators are asking anyone who thinks they may be a victim in this case to call police. Lawrence Woods will appear in court Tuesday morning. Live in the studio, Kyle Mitchell, NBC 25 News.